Aloha, this is the Green Lighting Mr. T, and welcome back to more Metroid Prime low percent, oh my god, low percent run! <laughs> get that out of the way. Oh, last time, I went through hell to get to the save station and claim power bombs. I am so happy to have gone through this section. And I have learned quite a few things. One, the the beam type space pirates are really, really bad to fight. Which honestly, it occurs to me that during the Omega Pirate, is it going to be Omega Pirate? Yeah, Omega Pirate fight, there's going to be, I'm going to have to deal with those guys again. I'm hoping that maybe with power bombs I can alleviate that issue. Because you, you can take out them with the power bomb. It doesn't matter what type there are, I think. I'll have to test that, I guess. And then just the fact that... Uh, sorry. <laughs> I am... Well, I'm eager to play more. I don't know what I'm getting myself into anymore. It's hard to be stalling so much. I've just been through my own little rigorous trial of getting everything up and running, oddly enough, while I was setting up something that has not... Yeah, I figured as much. Uh, because I saved and everything. These guys are now in the room. Where before I could have just left the room. Like, it's because I save and quit that these guys are in the room. I have no missiles. Alright, fine, we're freezing you pitifully over and over until you're dead. So, as I was saying, um, right now I am, of course, using my Elgato. Oh. 60S? I think, yeah, HD 60S. Yes, that's it. And for whatever reason, I use Movi to record my audio separately. I could let the... Um, Alright, please don't die. I could use let the Elgato do it now. It has, of course, the capabilities to record commentary, but I like having my commentary separate. It makes it easier to do any sort of syncing stuff with it later on. And let's me, uh, you know, adjust the volume as necessary. But, but at the same time, like, the Elgato can do that. And it can even separate it afterwards. Like, it can take the, the game audio and my co commentary and separate it completely. That's just extra work that I don't have to do if I just record it separately, so that's how I like to do it. However, for whatever reason today... Yes, I can scan these. Um, they were just not wanting to cooperate with each other. The... Elgato was making the Movi... It's, it's Movavi, actually. I just nickname it Movi because that's easier for me to say. Um, they just, it was ca causing the audio recording to, to crash. It was quite the mystery and puzzlement. Is, I just want to know, is there like goodies in here that I can access? Yeah, I don't know. I don't see any. We're just going to ignore this. I still want some missiles, but you know, there's probably some over there maybe. I don't know. No, it's better that I don't have to deal with the ice troopers. So, I finally um, got it to work by... It, w it wasn't even um, the software, opening the software, causing the other software to crash. It was plugging the hardware in that was causing it to crash. So eventually I figured I had to plug it in without the input 
and then put the input in, and then everything was working. So I don't... It was a definitely confusing situation, but um, I am finally up and running now, and I can just play the game finally. <sighs> so, with that all said and done... Oh, we have another one of these guys, right? Yep. These guys I'm not so worried about much anymore. The first guy was uh, pretty easy to deal with. All I have to do is just time the jumps, not st get too far away to the point where uh, he'll start using the cannon. Just wait out until he stops holding up his hand otherwise. And I'm not getting shot at! It feels great! <laughs> They're really, it's like, these are the big bad guys they're all wor worried about in this place, but now it's like the exact opposite. I still don't know, like, how much damage, it, like, they can do to me, because, you know, I've avoided the damage, but, uh... I, it makes me very happy to not have to worry about these encounters. <laughs> Just like that! It makes me feel good about um, the Omega fight. <laughs> of course, as I mentioned, the issue is, again, I'm going to have the beam troopers coming in during that fight. So I may not be out of the woods entirely. I feel like it's another expression I've latched onto. Out of the woods. It's a good expression. Right, yeah, I've scanned that. Four? Hmm. Why do I... It, does it just start you with three, but you can actually hold four? Is that how it works? Okay, maybe I can hold four. That's a little weird. Because I definitely had it. Oh, when you get it, the first bomb you lay gets, is actually used. That's a little weird. <laughs> That's an interesting uh, bit of information, but uh, all right. If that, as long as that explains why I'm able to hold four, and it's not because I magically got a expansion pack while I wasn't looking. Okay, I know this room is important for something. I was thinking maybe it was a save room. Nope, it's a map room, and that explains why I remember it being important. Okay, so the entire bottom level of this area is still, but otherwise we have to go off and get the plasma beam, right? No. Grapple. No, we have the grapple. Okay, grapple beam first, then plasma beam. Yeah, 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 that's it. <laughs> On the bright side, I don't have to deal with the normal beam pirates in that room because I had to fight the Omega Pirate. It's so weird that they're suddenly the easier thing to deal with. Um, another thing that I thought of off camera was that the puffers? <laughs> yeah, I was wondering about that. Hmm. Well, I don't see them coming. I was trying, gonna shoot the couple of them just to top off my health. Oh, there we go. I don't know if they're gonna want to drop. Oh, nope, they did drop a power bomb. Perfect. Okay, fold up. Um, yeah, <laughs> finish what I was talking about. So, there's a version of the puffers. There's a different version of the puffers. I think they're called puffers. Okay, don't want the energy tank, just want the poison gas to be gone. Um, that I don't know whether I'll be able to see. Um, they're where the upgrade to the, to the wave combo beam is. Um, I know they're there. If they're not anywhere else, 
I don't know if I can get them to spawn, because if I call right, they respawn after you've destroyed the first column. And to destroy the first column, you're going to need 20 missiles. And I don't think there's a way to refur refurnish missiles in that room. So I might not actually be able to get 100% uh, scans as I was hoping. Please leave me alone. There we go. Once I get the plasma beating, though, a lot of these enemies will become a lot easier to fight. That's a nice thing to think about. Plasma beam is really strong. So, I'll have to see about that, I guess, if I can help it. Because I don't know that there's any other location I can go to get, th get those enemies to appear. This is not the way I want to go. Yeah, the splash damage only has the... Okay, it does do damage. Okay, maybe it does like regular damage with the splash damage or something like that. So it definitely still freezes. Oh, and before Plasma Beam, we still have to go get the X-Ray Visor. Man, there's a lot of little, uh, sidetrack business we have to do before we ever return here. Can't remember how the ordering works, though. I don't need anything. I feel like the X-Ray Visor must be the last thing you get, or does it not matter the order you get it in? I know definitely Grapple Beam before Plasma Beam, but that's, like... That's, uh, uh, like, obvious, because, uh, you need the grapple to get the plasma beam. Plasma? Yes. Eee, it's so hard to aim up. This suit apparently does not have good range of motion. Ah, PT jokes. By the way, my <laughs> that's the other thing. My uh I am done with my summer course semester. Summer Yes. I said that correctly. Um So that means I get way more time to uh dedicate to my channel and make sure everything is up and running and full being fully caught up and even prepared for the future. It all sounds wonderful, doesn't it? I've also discovered that I, uh, this is a dangerous hobby I have. <laughs> it's just, it piles on work after work. <laughs> Where is this thing? Over there? I mean, that has to be right. Because there's nothing over here to indicate that it wants to be, oh, nope, that's the grappling thing. Yeah, it must be over there. Okay. See if I can look down. Yep, alright, perfect. Ah. So I don't know whether I'm gonna have another like little montage of struggling with another section of the game. I it might happen at the Omega Boss, don't know yet. And of course the final boss, which is the uh Oh, jeez, don't even forget Ridley. Yeah, we got a whole bunch of stuff up ahead of us. Hopefully I can make it, make it through all of it. Okay. Yep, I got it right. Perfect. At long last. Or for, for the for the fact that you get to have this at the beginning of the game, they sure make you wait for it. Once you have it. Okay, now we should scan these. Yep. Eh, who cares? We know what it does.
Okay. Hmm. And I love it when they just sit there and do nothing while they watch their friend get frozen solid. Ah, so much easier to deal with this room when I'm not dealing it from, like, underneath all the pirates. Ooh, that makes things simple. Alright, um... Technically, I don't need to scan that. Can just swing across? Oh, there's another one. Hold on. Okay. Alright, I don't know where I'm going. But I guess I can just freely drop down. I don't need anything with any of this stuff here. Nope, didn't drop anything. Okay. So that was so much easier a trip traveling trip than the chaos that was getting down to the the area with all the upgrades. Oh, what a relief it is. Okay. Oh, that's that's that room. Okay. Wondering if I should go do the key now or do that later. Probably just do it on my back trip when I have the plasma beam so I can do more damage. Yeah, that's smart. Alright, do it then. Because we still have that other crazy pirate thing, whatever it's supposed to be. The unstable... What do they call it? Like a pirate... Elite, yeah, they call them pirate elites, and then that's like a pirate captain. I don't know. I don't remember the names of the enemies. And we have the version that's supposedly more sta unstable than the others that really doesn't feel any different when fighting. Just you don't have the added bonus that they don't get a cannon equipped. fine way to get back. You know, am I about I might actually be strop, dropping by where the uh, x-ray visor is. That would be a good setup. Oh, I've already opened it, haven't I? Yes, I did. In fact, like, this is plain the room. Stop it. Okay. Can you, like, die, please? Yeah, alright. Die to your own f f dying to your own fumes. Perfect. Oh, what a mess. Right. I have access. Hey, yeah, this is very much where I get the x-ray visor, right? Because you go up here and then there's the room blocked by benzenium stuff. And then I get my x-ray visor, I think. 
Hopefully it's as simple as this. Is this the right... correct direction? You see, there's that over there. That's a different direction. I mean, <laughs> for all intents and purposes, I do need to break this. Just break it. I feel like it's not that way. That's not the way. So where's... Where's that ice door and where's that... I see two other doors for other directions to travel in, but I don't... Have I just not been in here? Oh, here's an elevator that would have been nice to know about. Um... So maybe I do want the blue door. Gosh, I've made this so hard on myself. I have to climb up the room again. supposed to be going. Okay, surely this is to the place where the x visor is. And you know, it makes sense, like, to have, you need the power bombs to get to the x-ray visor, I guess, so maybe I should have just realized that was correct from the start. Oh yeah, this is definitely the place. How did you survive? I definitely just blew up. And you didn't die alongside me. Just, whatever. I'm pretty sure I'm going to be face facing Crozo ghosts. And I just want to be ready for it. Oh my god. Okay, over here. So I'd like to know when I'm supposed to see them. Is it now? Okay, it's now. Ah, um, right, X-ray visor, yes! That was so annoying. Okay, freaking got hit right off the bat. I'm trying so hard to avoid damage. And I just pray they don't like get behind me. Oh, God, okay. 
please provide good enough cover, you blasted tree. Thank you for being a tree. No, oh my god, I'm alive. Okay. Okay, I really can't afford another hit then. Okay, they can get behind me. That is the worst news. I took one out though. Okay, okay, there's only one left. I can handle this one. And now I have health. Oh, thank goodness. I'm so glad not to have to just waste time, you know, dying. Because <laughs> that's the worst thing that happens when you die. You waste time. Oh. <sighs> Alright, now that that's dealt with, let's go get our key. I forgot to turn off discard again. Whoops. <laughs> I got so distracted with getting everything set up, I completely forgot the standard procedures. not going to be a nice little shortcut. That's what I was hoping it would be. Okay. So now that we have the x-ray visor, nothing changes. We're still off to get the plasma beam. <sighs> Extra visor is just only necessary for making your life easier and then defeating the big ol' space pirate Omega thing. Because you technically can't a attack it without it. Even if you're shooting at the right spot, it won't do any damage. Or, you know, act like it's hitting him. You know, despite all the crazy lighting effects from him absorbing Phazon. Alright, now where do I truly go? Okay, that door is just to a missile pack. I guess I must have died at some point when discovering that, because it's not marked on the map anymore. I've definitely... Or maybe I just opened the door, saw what's inside, and didn't walk in. That's also a possibility. Alright, definitely taking this elevator definitely beats going through the entirety of... Um, the underwater area. So that is one very long trek. Should I, like, shoot these for, like, health? I probably should. Let's see. Any health, guys? Any health? Goodies? No? I'm still out of missiles. Nope, we've got none for me. So where is this? Oh, is this like the other elevator? Yeah, it's the other elevator that I didn't take. You know, I didn't take either of the elevators apparently. Or I did and I died and then I didn't care to go back because it was already the wrong way. Look, it's the, it's the magical energy tank the game wants me to get. Alright. So this does provide one thing that I do need, or at least want to have right now, and that is the ability to save. Because I've been going for a while now. So, next part, 
I shall be heading to get the plasma beam, because that's all that remains before we head back to deal with more troubling pirates. This has been the Green Lightning Mr. T. I hope you enjoyed today's episode, and to you I say, Aloha!